Hello and very warm welcome to Raflims. This is Farooq Hussain. In this hands-on video tutorial, we will learn how we can download Windows ISO file and how we can create a virtual machine through that ISO file by using VMware. So let's start this video. Here, I uh, let me open my web browser, and there you can see we can use this website or any other website. You can use uh, Google. You can find out how you can download. Uh, Windows ISO file. So this website specifically give you Windows 10 ISO uh, in portable disk images. So you can see this a number of options available. So you can have them uh, in an ISO file, and then you can burn that ISO uh, on a disk on 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 uh, a USB. Uh, but here we are going to use that ISO for for uh, a virtual machine. Uh, and to try Windows 10, basically we need an activation key to have the Windows 10. So we are using without the activation key. And there you can see we can download Windows 10 uh, in 64 bit or 32 bits. So this is the latest version here and we can download this. So I have already downloaded this and let me open my VMware so I can show you how we can use that ISO. ISO file is sort of zip file and uh, I want to create a new virtual machine and then I'm using a workstation 15.5 that is licensed to me and uh, install disk image and I need to select where the image is available so I have already downloaded this and uh, here, there. there you can see Windows 10 open this and next and there you need to select windows microsoft windows and you can provide the name like uh, only windows or any other name you can so i am going to use at least 80 gb as the hard disk and uh, the ram would be 6 gb and finish the setting and there i can power to this virtual machine now it's loading the system so there you can select the language setup and the keyboard layout and also you can select the time and currency format so i just go with the default next and now you can install this And of course, we do not have the activate activation key here. So I would say I don't have a product key. And you can select the what actually you want to install. I just go with Windows 10 Pro and next. I accept all license terms. So this is just for demo purpose and we can select the custom because we are not here to upgrade. We are here to install and that option is perfect. So we can format the uh, 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 what we said the partition or we can create a partition. But let us go with this because we have free space 80 GB and uh, that's enough to go and next and now start working so it will copy the file and then getting file ready for installation and then installing features installing updates getting finished and we have to be very patient here we have to very relax here you can come up with some other works 
and uh, let me pause my video here and i'll just come back when it may come okay so it has complete all the process and now it's getting ready so now we need to let's start with the region Pakistan here and yes go with the I think let us go with that the skip for second keyboard layout Now we have some important setting up to do. Okay, thanks for your patience. Hello, this is Farooq Hussain. I have a good news. If you or your organization looking for expert deployment and training of any open source, integrated library system, digital library system, institutional repositories, discovery and guided tools, standards and protocols, so you can connect me through my Fiverr account. It's fiverr.com backslash Farooq Hussain. F-I-V-E-R-R.com backslash F-U-R-R-U-K-H-H-U-S-S-A-I-N. Or you can directly connect me through my email address. It's a farooq.hussain at the rate gmail.com. So you will receive a 20% discount if you directly connect me through my email address. So what are you waiting for? Don't waste your time. Connect me now through Fiverr or my email address if you need an expert. Okay, so this is for... Sign in to enjoy a range of Microsoft apps. So you can sign in if you have Microsoft account. But I just go with the offline access. Who is going to use this PC? Okay, so I just write uh, my apps. So you can provide password. I just use one sample password. Uh, you can select any secret questions uh, like uh, security question if you forget the password any like uh, And now always have access to your recent browsing data mm -hmm. not now choose privacy setting for your device so location 
and required optional diagnostic data and blah 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 can provide the location if you would like to but okay finally <laughs> is there anything else so Finally, you want to allow your PC to discoverable by other PCs and devices on this network? I don't think so right now. Okay, so finally we have installed Windows 10 on a VM through the VMware. So thank you very much for watching the Afrims. This is Swarov Hussain.